Ah, yes, here we go again, back into Happy Room, where our various volunteers are lining up for an exciting adventure for cupcakes, and I don't know what happened to that guy. Something, something dangerous happened to that guy. Speaking of dangerous things, let's head back into the laboratory, where we can use our zombified friend. We could actually give him the human skin, but... YouTube doesn't like red Kool-Aid all over the screen, so... Ta-da! It's a zombie! Oh, yes. This is satisfying. His hat fell off. I feel bad for him. Oh! Wow! Okay. That was a little gruesome. So was that. And, uh, that. I wonder if one of his limbs are gonna come off. That'd be kind of exciting. He just got shot with shotguns. And he just collected the last mine, got stuck on the ceiling. He's missing both of his forearms. That's good, because he's a zombie, and there is a lot of gross stuff happening on the back of that screen. Maybe we should speed it up a little bit, just to see if anything else will happen and we can break our new high score. Nope, he's just gonna lay down and pretend to play dead. But we know he's not actually dead. So I feel like we should clear all the zones of the map and start over. I really just wanna see what all of my money and mines will do. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh, that was kind of fun. I feel like, I feel like I need to upgrade my mines. Can I upgrade my mines? Explosions, upgrade. Mines on the walls and ceilings. That's not nearly as fun. But I could try my grenade launcher. Kind of expensive. Okay, it's really expensive. <laughs> oh, but it does a lot of damage. Oh, that's cool. Oh, no, bounce over to the other side. There you go. Oh, no. Oh, yay. Yay. <laughs> He's getting bombed. Oh, I hit a dummy with five grenades. I got more money. But he's stuck. I almost got a new high score. So let's try something else. Yep, bomby boy. Wow, the bombs have to jump 200 times? I don't think this is gonna work. They're not jumping at all. They're not having a party. They're not, this is, okay, we got some jumps going on. There we go. <laughs> Look at this one. He's like, yes, I love jumping. I'm jumping so much I'm rolling. And then the roll, each roll counts. Oh, <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, they're stuck over here. But we did it. They jumped 200 times because they're extremely bouncy. And there's something satisfying about this because we just got a new high score. Oh, and he's missing some limbs. I can almost afford another upgrade. Oh, it's going to be so close. Yay, I just got the stake. Oh boy, Vlad the Impaler would be proud. Oh, I got stuck. That's okay. I now have the stake. Oh boy, it looks so dangerous. I don't even know what it does. I don't remember. We're going to put it right here. And then we're gonna do something fun like give it the uh, ice gun. I want the ice gun to freeze him when he's on the stake. Also putting in the rest of my money into mines right down here. So he gets all sorts of exciting stuff happening to him. And maybe, maybe one grenade launcher because that also sounds fun. All right, let's see how this goes. Yep, get frozen, get grenaded, get staked. <laughs> oh no, you escaped, you monster. He's not supposed to escape. Not on my watch. A slight adjustment of certain devices. Aw, oh, it's too close. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there it is. Hit him again. Oh, no. Oh, what? Wait, what? Where are you going? That's a little awkward. <laughs> and our freezer totally didn't work like I wanted it to. So I'll try the next best thing. Bombs plus axes. Yay. Wait, we got to hit the three grenade ricochet off axe hit dummy. Okay, that might be a little bit more difficult than I thought it was gonna be. Yeah, because I literally just got zero. I'm gonna raise that one up just a little bit. Yeah, because I want I want it to bounce off the X. Oh, I got one. Oh, I got three. I don't even know what I did, but I did it. Oh, this might work. This might work. Decapitation. Oh, it missed. Come on, bud. Lose your head. It looks pretty beat up. Not gonna lie. It looks dangerous. We lost an arm. I think that's what's rolling down. Oh, come on. Oh, that was a good one. It's always good when you get the Wilhelm scream. And, oh, that broke. No, we need more damage. Maybe we can get the more damage with the zero gravity machine. Or possibly the laser. But we'll just try lots of bombs first. Because I feel like bombs make everything better. And then I'll just have to watch him ride on the treadmill of death for like seven straight hours until his, all of his limbs fall off. But my score keeps creeping higher and higher and higher and higher. And I get to unlock more toys. And then I get to put these toys on the wall because they're very cheap. And then I get to run with it and see what happens. I don't really know. Oh, oh, that's a lot of damage. Yes, yes, melt our little dummy. I almost feel bad. Yikes. <laughs> He's burning. We got the burninator here. 
Oh no, they're all gone. That makes me sad inside. Oh, but there's the mini laser. I forgot about the mini laser. Can I upgrade the mini laser? Hello, mini laser. 30% more damage. That sounds fun. How many mini lasers can I use? I will promise you that he will not like going in this one specific location. I'm not exactly sure why, but I don't think he's gonna like it. I don't remember what the mini laser does. So let's test it out and see what actually what happens. Oh, okay. Oh, it's burning up. That's not good. Okay, maybe it is good. Okay, how much damage does he do right there? Not that much. Interesting. Make it go faster. That's a good sound. I like laser sounds. I feel like this is not the right way that these lasers are intended to laze. I didn't realize they would be constantly on. Or maybe it's not. Maybe they're only on while they're doing damage. They are. Interesting. I don't think I like them very much. Okay, this doesn't look like much. But we're gonna do this. Three times in a row, pierce a dummy with the same stake. Now that we're not talking like a meat, like a piece of meat. We're talking about like an actual stake. Uh-huh, two, three. Yeah! Okay, I gotta redo that. We gotta get more bouncy boys over here. No, no, that was, whatever. That wasn't what I wanted you to do, but I'm glad you did it. Okay, and then just do it one more time. Oh, wow, it, it actually has to be the same stake three times. Let's see if it hits something else. Does it get broken? Okay, there's one. Oh yeah, it totally doesn't work how I wanted it to. Especially since my stake really only has two charges, I think. Really? Okay, one. Yeah, it only has two charges. How can I hit it three times in a row with the same stake? That's illegal. I need a third poiki poiki. Just made up a new word called poiki poiki. I hate to cheese the game, but I feel like this is really the only way I can continuously level up. So we'll just use the bombs and then do this and then you'll blow up. It'll be not very exciting, but I'll get to unlock lots of fun things. And I'll just let them go on the treadmill. And then we'll keep getting new high scores so we can spend even more money. I really gotta f figure out a way to do this one. Off with his head. Behead a dummy with an axe. We'll try it. I don't really know the best way to do this because axes don't do that much damage. And, well, I gotta soften them up a little bit. And that didn't, it didn't even get close. Did some limbs. How about acid? <laughs> it might work. Or it, or it might, it might not work. I mean, it still might work, maybe. Or maybe maybe something will work. I really just need to tear a limb off when it's attached to acid. That's all I need to do in life right now. Come on, yes, I did it. I tore a limb off. These are very difficult. All of these challenges are stupidly hard right now. So we'll try the frozen one in the same method that we just did, because it could work, maybe. The ax does do a lot of damage if it hits. Oh, he did lose a limb, but he wasn't frozen. No, get back over there, get frozen and jump. No, no, yes! What? What? Hey, hold on. Yay, it worked! <laughs> Yay, I feel like a weird, like, murder kind of guy. It's kind of creepy. Like celebrating ripping organs off. Activate zero gravity four times. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I can do that. And we just cover the map with anti-gravity. It can't fail. I'm also gonna use sticks and not the meaty kind of sticks, like the actual, like, game, like, pokey thing again. I think we've covered that before. I'm $1 short from buying one of those. Wow, that was hard. 10 seconds in anti-gravity. Oh my, the huge manatee. Poke him, throw him. It's not working. Look at the, the low amount of damage I've done to. Come on, I just want to get thrown. I just want to throw you for like a year. Ah, oh, that's so close. Boo. But at least I can spawn a bunch of monsters and then let them go, and yay, 10 monsters in zero gravity. They like it, because it's exciting and fun. At least I can upgrade my stakes now. I just really want to get that three meter thing. Can we get the three meter deal, please? Two, three, yes! It's not working, <laughs> it's not working at all. I feel like I need to put stakes on the ceiling. Stakes on the ceiling, stakes on the ceiling. This sounds dangerous, but there's stakes on the ceiling. Do you like my song? I just made it up. Yay, it worked. I don't even know what I did, but I might be able to keep all of these monsters in the air for 30 seconds. Oh wow, it has to be straight the whole time. Yikes. But if I do twice the speed, it only has to be in there for 15 seconds, which I kind of think, oh, I could do, maybe? You know what I need to do? I need to upgrade my my anti-gravity thingy-mabobbers. 
Upgrade time. Where is it? In here? Happy, happy noises. Anti-gravity. Works two times longer. Very nice. That should be easy peasy lemon squeezy. Or not, because he falls and I don't have the things in the right place. You know what I should do? This will be even more fun. Oh, I can't put these on the ceiling yet? What? That's illegal. I'll just spread it out a little better. That'll work. Maybe. Why didn't it work? That's annoying. So I'll just go back to the treadmill and then try to do that 8,000 damage one, which I should easily be able to do. Because I have a lot more bombs now. Ready? Ready? And blow up mode. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's working. Oh, yeah. That's super easy. Test of endurance five. And then I can buy even more explosive mines. Hey, I did it. And that gives me piranhas. Oh my. And shurikens. And a whole lot more money that I can use to invest in more bomb bomby boys. That allows me to get the gravity gun. And a new record. So I can buy even more bomby boys. And then somehow he manages just to jump on the saw blades and not move anywhere. Even though there's plenty of energy left in the rest of the sauce. I'll forgive you though, because I really want him to go swimming with the piranhas and then get lasered at the same time. Not gonna lie, placing these mini lasers down is one of the worst things ever. If you accidentally put it in the wrong spot, it's like, just kidding, we can't let you put it there. And then the game just cries. He has to fly through the 12 mini lasers? This isn't flying. But maybe, maybe laying down on a treadmill of death consists of flying. I don't, I'm not really sure though, because I'm not a bird. I don't know how to fly. And I know what you're saying. You're probably saying like, oh, Blitz, you don't need to be a bird to fly. That's one of the dumbest things I've ever heard. And the next thing you know, you can like buy a ticket to go ride in a big metal thing that goes through the air. Doesn't even make any sense, but you're saying it does. How about that for a trap? Oh, and I have a little bit of money that I can buy mines. This will be exciting. I don't know. Something about this looks absolutely terrifying. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dummy flies through 12 lasers and then gets piranha Wait, what? Why? Oh, the piranhas are still gnawing on him. <laughs> look at him. Look at the piranha boys. That's hilarious. I love it. I don't know why. Go faster. Get lasered and stuff. Wow. That's that's absolutely brutal. <laughs> the piranhas just ripped off the leg and they're like, oh boy, we get to eat this forever now. It's going to be an interesting idea. What would happen? Mm, even better ideas. Look at me. I got, I got the smarts in my head today. If I, let's see, if I make you bounce yourself up over here and then I can do like this and then wait, there's more. We can put in the saw blades in here. Okay, okay, are you, are you picking up what I'm putting down? The objective is that crash test dummy boy number zombie is gonna jump over the edge and then he's gonna fall down through here. That's the goal. I think we can make this work. And then if I put in anti-gravity gobbers in here, I just made up a new word again. Look at me using my engineering degree for science purposes. And then we'll put in like I, the 10 of these, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's a bunch more than 10. Keep the monsters in zero gravity for 30 seconds. The objective is that this guy is going to jump down. He's going to hit this thing. He's going to sploing over here, get up into here, and then he's just going to fall constantly through there. And then the monsters are going to do whatever they do. Also, lasers. We got to have lasers for science purposes. Am I right or am I right? All right, let's try that. Activate, bounce, anti-gravity, anti-gravity, anti-gravity. It's working. It is working. It is working. It is working. Zombies in the air. Zombies in the air. Daily in 10 seconds. The uh, monster in the zero gravity didn't work, though. Huh. <laughs> All the little monsters like, I wanted this so bad, I don't want to eat him. Wait, he's taking damage from the portal? How does that even work? I do want to try that again, though, because I feel like it could actually function. Yeah, see? The monsters... Oh, it didn't work. Go down and bounce to the side. <laughs> it's so strange. This game's weird, man. How do I keep 10 monsters in the air? I have an idea. We'll upgrade this. I want it upgraded twice so I can put on the ceiling. Let's just go back to the piranha tank again because we have to do that for this one. And a dummy flies clockwise three times around a block with mini lasers. That's just a, that's just weird. With four mini lasers, so we have to upgrade the block. Yikes. So we'll just try lots of bombs and piranhas this time. Oh yeah, the piranhas are all over them. Yay, we used all the piranhas in a block. 
burn the dummy down in the water, then freeze him in another one. What? Burn burn the dummy down in the water and then freeze him in another one? So he needs to be frozen and burning at the same time? I forgot there was a fire gun. Okay, burn the dummy down in the water and then freeze him in another one. We got burning, we got freezing. Activating. Okay, he's frozen, he's burning, and then freeze him in another one. That was that was stupidly easy. <laughs> Hit a dummy eight with a stake eight times when he's in the water. I can do these, man. I'm so good at I'm at this. It's probably not a good thing to keep on your resume. Like really good at torturing zombies. Yeah, probably not the best thing to tell your parents about. Hey, guess what I did at work today, mom? <laughs> I uh, stabbed a zombie while in water. Actually kind of satisfying. Look at all those piranhas on him. <laughs> Yay! If you haven't figured it out yet, I'm just trying to get more money so I can buy more explosives and then I can use more explosives to explode things. I promise Mr. FBI agent, I'm playing a video game. Don't come knocking at my door. And you know the rule. If I get to blow them up, I get to unlock things like that plasma gun. And maybe if it's good enough, I can get whatever missiles that thing is. Or not. But I did get a new record. I really don't want to do this. Oh, yes, yes, the double jumpers. I can get double bouncers now. Okay, if I get double bouncers, I can put them on the ceiling. And then I can just make like a circle of death in here. And it's also saying I can do another one or not. I really want to upgrade the block. Okay, objective. Keep 10 monsters in zero gravity for 30 seconds. This should be exciting because these are all bouncy boys and it's just going to make it bounce all over the place. Except uh, I incompetently put the bouncy boys on the wrong way. Why did I, why did I put, why, why did I think it was a good idea to put those jump pads going that way? See, this is exactly what I meant to do. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> um, okay. These need to be exactly left and right, but I still might get it. I still might get it. Come on, that was so close. Okay, you need to bounce. You need to bounce left and right just to get it square straight away from the rest of the world. And then this should work. Doink, doink. <laughs> Yay. Come on, monsters. 10 seconds. I think the crash this dummy actually likes this. Oh, no way. It stopped. Oh, that's so annoying. It was so close. And one more time. Eventually, this will work, I promise you. Actually, I just made that up. I have no idea if it'll work or not. Problem is that I use up all of the bouncy things too fast. I use up all of the gravity too quickly. So what happens if I use like uh, on the walls instead of the bouncy boys? Because they might bounce it too quickly. What happens if I use like the shotgun? It's not that expensive and it should just hit it to go the other way. Yeah, just a little bit of a boost back and forth. It's working better, I feel. They just needed to be slower. Uh-oh. Oh, get across. Get across. Yes. 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 It's working. It's functioning. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. It's going to stop. It worked. Oh, it's going to work. It's going to work. It's going to work. Oh, that was so close. And it worked. I did it. 170 more money. I don't even know what this means, but I have to keep a dummy in ice and gravity ray for 15 seconds. I haven't even used these gravity rays in years. Like, literally, I haven't played this game in years. But I remember these things being kind of garbage. So I don't know how this is going to go. Okay, we're frozen. I mean... Well, we're doing this one, anyway. The other one's kind of working. And it doesn't have to be consecutive. So it might actually work. Those do a lot of damage. Splatted dummy from both balls with a plasma cannon? I don't even know what that means either. I feel like I have to level up probably the ice gun in order to make this work. And this should work. It actually looks pretty cool. That whole gravity thing there, doesn't it? Oh, its head fell off. I almost feel bad. Get over to the left. I mean, the other, the other way, the right. Come on, more ice guns, no bouncy pads on the top. Wow, that shreds it. Why is that shredding it so badly? I feel bad. Oh, we got so close. But I almost got the disco ray. <laughs> disco time. Disco weapon. Wow. A discatality. I remember that one. Oh, no. We have so much life left. I legit have no idea why this is doing so much damage. The good news is I just unlocked the big rocket. Let's see how this does. I like the treadmill. It always seems to help us when we need to do things right. Or not. We're going to do this one. This has got to work. I promise you it'll work. Uh-huh. Gravity goes down. So much gravity. He's in the air forever. Wow, he might actually... We might actually get a fatality on this one. Wouldn't that be sick? An actual real-life fatality in the game. His head fell off. Oh, come on. 
You're supposed to go down that hole, dude. Do you not remember this? Do you not remember what portals are for? You're supposed to just bounce down into the portal. That didn't work. Why did I guarantee that? Money back. You can have your money back. Fine, I'll use boring old bounce pads again, game. Is that what you want me to do? What happens if I put the stupid block in the middle and then put, like, the... the gravity gun on the side of it just so we can get some middle point here see how that works see how nice that is wow he's being absolutely obliterated just made up a new word called the obliterated it's so close oh it's so close why is it so far away get over there yes yes it worked it worked i did the thing and i tell you what my friends that will do it for today's episode of happy room we had some fun with lasers and piranhas and gravity guns and it was exciting so thanks for watching and keep your stick on the ice we'll catch you next time and i'd like to thank everyone who signed up on patreon including ben ellen hagen dicky james apollo bunny auto dave eagle arc whip it good seraphin x des bogger maxer zarnoff legacy jason mcfarland deacon paul longstone and ralph and everyone who has clicked that join button down below to become a youtube channel member